Canada. Check my website out. This is what I'm grinding for. Oh, can you, uh, yes, I need a nice photo. Put my city on. <laughs> five one nine. This is. That's okay. Is that call the office. <laughs> call Hello? the office. What are you wearing? <laughs> what are you doing right now? You know what this is. That's what's what up. What's your girl calling? Oh, dude, no Hi, troublemaker. <laughs> <laughs> so we want to talk about. Okay. Well, first of all. Who am I? Who are you? Introduce yourself to Canada, the world, Montreal, Toronto, Kitchener. Hi there, I'm Lisa Ann, and I'm presently in Montreal, Canada. I'm saying hello to everybody everywhere, Canada, the States, all over the world. And I think you may know me. How would we know, how would they know you? We may have had an intimate moment together. Luckily, I like, don't have to be there for all of them because the hundreds and thousands have probably happened in just one night alone, but I manage them well by providing more content for guys to have moments with me. And I've become a very good girlfriend because you can just turn me on and turn me off whenever you want. I'm always there for you. I don't cost you any extra money. I don't hassle you. And I get to keep all these men in the world happy and I don't have to deal with them for you. Wow, okay. <laughs> what are your thoughts on the um, adult entertainment industry? Are you ready? Is that what you said? C collabing. I'm personally, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> This is too much. Can I just get access to the fridge so we can? Look at this guy, he's always in the way, right? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's terrible. What did I do? Is what did you do? Just jumped in our interview. <laughs> <laughs> what was your question? Your thoughts on the collaboration of like, you guys are here on Muggs' set, so awesome. with hip hop and the adult entertainment industry. Well, we kind of go hand in hand and we have for a long time. Um, I've been mixing music in with my career since I started. I toured with Reach Against the Machine for a period of time. Went to a ton of their shows, and uh, I was in the Eminem video for We Made You, which was last year. And um, I've done some other appearances with musicians, so I could see it, it bleeding more and more together. If I could only get myself on the bench on a regular basis with like a sexy basketball team, can you make that crossover happen for me? Like, be the towel girl or water girl or help them with their showers? Like, because I'm happy with the music thing. This is great. Muggs is a sexy motherfucker. Okay, I'd take a team of Muggs any day. Uh, but, you think you could work on this basketball thing with me? <laughs> I'll try my best. I mean, it's kind of a dream of mine. Okay. You know, you're a young kid, you have aspirations. I just want to be a water girl for, you know, the heat, maybe. Even though I'm a Lakers fan, oh, I'll take man. that fucking three-way with those boys in a second. Lakers Wade, fan. Wade, fucking Posh, fucking LeBron, I love LeBron so much. That's what's up. Well, so he knows what's... it because I just met him a month ago at a club and I couldn't even speak, man. It was, it was epic because I'm a LeBron stalker, so I know that if he sees me somewhere, he's not going to want to mess with me because I've talked about him in too many interviews and it's over. I've already killed it, which is probably better because I've made like sleep outside his house or something. So we're at a club together. Dwayne's there. He's there. Kim Kardashian's there. I'm there all in this area. I was staying in Miami. And my friends are like, go talk to him. I'm like, listen, I just want to watch him dance. Like, I just want to see what he listens to. Like, I want to see how he moves. Like, I just want to be here. Like, I don't, nothing good's going to come out of me. I, all I want to want is this cock in my mouth. Can you say that in your interview? Or you can say whatever you want. <laughs> so since that's not going to happen, because, you know, he probably doesn't, that's probably not a great idea. I just wanted to, like, view him from afar. So my friends, yeah, I got a couple of drinks in me, and I must have a little courage. So I walk over. And my security guy knows his security guy, so they do the whole, you know, yo, this is so-and-so. And I go to shake his hand, he touches my hand, he starts talking to me, I swear to God. It was like, all of a sudden, I couldn't hear a word he was saying. I felt my eyes welling up with tears, and I, like, turned into a super fan. And all I said to him was, it was really nice to meet you, because I'm a really big fan. I walked away. My friends took pictures of it and were laughing at me. Because <laughs> I walked back over to my area, they're like, that's it? That's all you got. You can't bust out that you're Lisa Ann. You can't like do something. You can't offer a second dick. I'm like, no. I just do. I'd be the same way if I met Michael Jordan. Yeah, okay. Just, just so you're a, you're a sports fan. Big time. Oh. But it, or I'll take it. Yeah. Sorry, guys. That's no problem. You can see you watch exchange. Them. Thank you. <laughs> all right, baby. Um, I'm a big sports fan. So I just really love guys. So, and since sports is a great place to see a lot of guys in one place, it's good to get involved in sports. So where could people find you or view you, see you? 
on my site, which is thelisaann.com. You can tweet with me at the real Lisa Ann. I love to tweet. It's the only reason I got an iPad. Well, and to read books about LeBron. JRD Canada is mine, so look out for that. JRD Canada, did yeah. you already tweet me? I'm gonna tweet you just now. All right, I, I'm gonna, I added you. I'll add you. I'll add you. Um, and also, you can find me on browsers on ZZ Insider, which is another subnet of browsers, and uh, at Lakers games since I go anytime I can. Oh, not a Lakers fan. Who are you a fan of? Not Lakers. Tell me who their team is. Maybe there's some boy on there I love. Oh, Who's your team? Oh, they're, they're that bad? I'm a Cowboys fan, so if I have to admit to you right now that I'm a Cowboys fan in the midst of this fucking season, then you motherfucker need to tell me who your fucking team is. No, no, no. I have a couple of teams. Boston, Denver, Dude, and do Miami. Do you love Rajon Rondo? Yeah. He's a little injured right now. He has a, like, a ligament issue. I think he just needs me to come over and rub it. Yeah. Most definitely. I like I like the Celtics. I like to watch them. I always watch him. Who else? Uh, Miami. Well, they're not God, doing. I can't they're not. not vibing yet. Yeah. You know. Yeah. It's a lot of power on that court. I just, I know that they're partying a lot because I know the night that we were all at the club, we were all there till like five, and then the next morning I turned on Sports Center and they were already at a press conference an hour away. It was like eight thirty in the morning. I was like, motherfuckers were partying the night before they had this shit to do. Nah, that's wild. <laughs> Okay, can we get a shout out, please? Avant Magazine, Avant? Test Avant. Avant Magazine, Test One, Lex Marcello. Yeah, there it is. Avant Magazine. Yes. Test One. One. What else? Lex Marcello. Lex. Lex. Okay. Action. This is a large shout out. Oh. You can break it up. I like to give a shout out to Avant Magazine. Tess, Tess one. Tess one. Lex Marcello, right? Yeah, we gotta do it all over. Cut, 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 cut. Action. I like to give a shout out to Avant Magazine. Tess one. Lex Marcello. I'm Lisa Ann. <laughs>